Hi, my name is Dr. Darren Schmidt. I've been studying hardcore holistic nutrition since 1994, and I've applied it to hundreds of thousands of patients since 1998, myself and my other practitioners in my office. So along the way, we've learned some fantastic information, including the Follow the Physiology Formula. I have a whole free ebook for you to read and an online learning course that's also free so you can get all the details. But I just released a blog and the blog has to do with the most common mechanism of chronic disease. It's called lactic acidosis. So lactic acidosis was actually um, discovered in cadavers in 1848 and then it was found in the majority of people chronically ill in the 1850s. They had a group of people who were chronically sick and most of them had a high level of lactate in their body. So that's kicked off this whole line of research that lasted a hundred years to the mid 1900s. And, but then it was forgotten after 1961. And it's very interesting on the history of this and that's what this blog is about. So what happened after 1961? It was forgotten mostly. This big expansive, this fantastic piece of information was broken up into two smaller bits of information. Number one, high lactate in the body or lactic acidosis for athletes. And number two, high lactate in people or lactic acidosis in people that have just a few days left to live. So how is it that you have these two extremes, the very healthy athletes and the people that are soon going to die? How is lactic acidosis only related to these two people and not to everybody else in between like you and me? So, but it does apply and that's what the doctors knew back in the 1930s and 40s is that people who are chronically ill have some degree of it and um, the rest of us need to do things to prevent it from ever happening. So click on the link so you can learn more about this and how it applies to you and then after you read the blog, jump into the free ebook. You can download it. You don't even have to give us your email address. And then when you're ready, jump into the e-course.